So have you ever noticed that Flurry's boob and Mario's nose are the exact same shape? Uh, <laughs> <Hey>. so, <laughs> Flurry just has two noses on her chest. That's it. Yep. She has like a hippo nose too. No, that's those are her boobs. Oh yeah, she just has a bunch. Or are tumors? She's just covered in a bunch of well, tumors. She's not human, so she probably has different body placements than we do. Oh, yeah. You know, and Nintendo's not the suggestive group. I mean, this game is rated E. Nintendo's probably like, oh, those are Flurry's, um, a nostrils. Your nostril sex. <laughs> Alright. Welcome All back right. to Paper Mario and the Thousand Year Door, everybody. Yeah, everybody. Glad to be back. Glad to be doing the same thing I always do. Totally not lying to you guys. Love it. <laughs> go, go to the pipe. If you're... Okay, never mind. We're gonna fight this piranha plant to start it off. Oh, there's two of them. Oh, look, they even got the pedestals in the background Ooh. that are in the room. Alright. We gonna try Let's it? Go, yep, let's see if I can do it. Because the problem last time is I forgot how it necessarily worked. I thought it was a spam A thing. Nice! We did it! Why? <laughs> <laughs> oh, man, we gotta find ways to get our, um, our star right. power back. What yeah. we should do is, like, if you ever have a turn to just do nothing with a character, appeal. Because that does get you free star power. Okay. Alright, down the pipe! Yep. Oh, Jesus Look Christ! At you, I don't know what sound I made there, but I was scared. Uh, run away, run away, run away. There he goes! They don't attack the punies, they only attack them long Yeah. Long. As long as I get... Got we really oh, put the puny orb in there. Okay. Wait, what? Oh, it was a trap! Okay. There's, uh, what well, just happens? Ba 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 It's Lord Crump! Man, you guys are dense. Pray a little trap, huh? And boy, did you bite on it. I saw you sticking your silly nose, your silly stone, on those pedestals, so I made a fake one. Awesome. I mean, I knew it was a great, but seeing you fall for it really gives me a warm fuzzy. <laughs> ba ba. Bob, Bob, Ryan, talk about complete idiots. You guys are so <laughs> dumb, it hurts. <laughs> anyway, your fool's out of the picture. I can take time hunting the crystal star. Bob, 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 Ryan. He's a big Beatles fan, I guess. I know. <laughs> I, I want to I piss people off, too, okay? Yeah, I know. I appreciate that. What Mario could just go paper thin, so leave them behind. This is actually going to lead you to get a new power-up. My, such wonderful drama. I imagine we have to do something now, don't we? Mario! <laughs> go down the pipe. Because little did Lord Crump... Sugar, we're going, going down swinging. I'll be a number one with a bullet. Whoa, look at this. Oh. This might be where we had to remember the thing. Shit! Pardon me a moment, don't these odd columns look somewhat familiar? These, we gotta... Okay, hit that switch. Whoa, 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 what's going on? Oh, I feel might swoon. So, you okay, hit that switch. Movie? No, you hit that switch, and now we gotta go back to that room with... That's the, that's the pattern we have to remember. Sun, moon, puny, star. 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 I think that'll that'll sink in yes. with the audience and us. So that way, if we ask in the comments, be like, what's the pattern? And then they'll just start singing. Sun, moon, puny, star. Sun, moon, puny, star. Oh, you brought Koops out. Got him. Oh crap, this is gonna do a lot of damage. Get ready to those action commands! Get ready to those action commands! <laughs> <laughs> and they're all going for Mario. Damn. Yeah, I did it. I think that's the strategy I though. It's like when you switch your partner in front of you, they have a higher chance of getting attacked. Oh. Damn it. Well, we know they have more than three health. And you can't jump on them, use your hammer. Yeah. Got oh, press X! Mario, fucking savage. <laughs> oh, man. I've never seen that. <laughs> now you have. That's the best thing I think I've ever seen. I kept life. it silent because I knew you were going to laugh at it. 
All right, so just use Shell Toss because you wasted all your flower points now. I can't use Shell Toss. Shell, you're thinking of Power Shell. Oh, we've, went over, we've went over this many times. I know, and I always forget. <laughs> shell Toss is just Coots' normal move. Damn it. Oh, you got a, a circle back. We're on the right track, baby. Come on, track, baby. Woo! You did it! Fuck your mama's couch. And you know what? It's a good thing that we're doing these long and arduous fights because we're getting a lot of star points. We do need to level up. We haven't done that since Petalburg. Yeah. But I really thought we did it in here. We have? Like, I thought we did it, um, like, two episodes ago or something like that. Was it after we fought the Shadow Sirens? I don't know. I remember we recently upgraded our BP, though. Uh, uh you got me. I don't remember. I... Point is, we haven't leveled up in a while. Yeah, but I feel like I'm doing something wrong because of the zero. No, because remember the I, I, got... I know, but I feel like I'm doing something wrong because I've had to keep that at 101. Okay, so... What was the pattern? Sun, moon, puny star. Sun, sun moon, moon, puny, puny star. star. Sun, moon, I actually forgot star. for a second. <laughs> I'm glad we invented that jingle. This is very helpful so I don't have to look it up on my phone. So we're going to that room so we can rearrange yeah. those patterns. Yep, yep. And then we'll get a new item. Oh, get the power boots. Yep. Because uh, we talked about this off screen, because Jake has played Paper Mario, as we established yes, many yes. times. And he noticed that those um, X's. Should we go for this while we're up here? The Shine Sprite? Yeah. Uh, I, I was going to say no, but you already went on it, so do it right this time. <laughs> oh, yeah, we did forget to do this off screen as well. Oh, well. Let's do it for the audience. Yay! Diddly -diddly -diddly -diddly. Sorry about that. Audience. Sun, moon, puny star. Sun, moon, moon puny, puny star. star. Sun, moon, puny star. star. I forgot that I changed my partner. <laughs> you want to get flurry out then? Yeah. How do I? Uh, start. So is it just party, and then swap partner? Oh, okay. And they jump inside Mario. Yeah, and switch there out. used to be a button for it in the other one just to change them out. It might be on the D-pad. Oh, never mind. D-pad's just a quick access. Oh, there it is. Yeah, D-pad's yeah, yeah. a quick access menu. Yeah, but it's still quick access to the partner's menu. I never remembered the D-pad things because I never minded pressing pause at all. But if you can memorize the D-pad things, I say go for it because it's a lot easier. Yeah. Wait, oh, where's the pedestals? That room? It was lower in the ground, I remember. So I, I went the wrong way. Yeah. Okay. It's all right. Sun, sun moon, puny star. Sun, sun moon, puny, puny star. star. Sun, sun moon, puny, puny star. star. Had a weird dream recently. Just last night, I was like, it was one of those dreams I was really sad that wasn't real. You know, I hear my woes yeah, tales. Yeah, I'd like to hear okay. your woe tales. <laughs> okay, so what it was is, um, I was at my dad's, uh, like a combination of my grandma's house on my mom's side and my dad's side. So it was this weird, like, maze kind of a house. And, like, nobody was around. It was like, um, it was kind of like, um, the Luigi game for the GameCube, Luigi's Mansion. And I was kind of, like, busting, like, creatures that were living in the house and, like, ghosts and stuff. Um, and, like, every time that I cleared a room, the lights would turn on, and I would be able to search the room for things. And I eventually went to my grandpa's room, and um, I cleared the room, and then the lights came on, and then the, there was a closet with a little thing that said, do not open. And I'm like, I'm going to open this. So I opened it, and there was just a bunch of clothes, but there was, like, something shining on the top shelf. And I'm like, what the, what is this? So I, like, pull out all this clothing... And I find three Game Cubes, all of the cords. I find um, an N64, an Atari 600, a PlayStation 1, 2, and 3, an Xbox 360, Sun, Moon, P, Star. Um. <laughs> See, these are the Switches. Uh, continue telling the story, but do you get it now? Yeah. All right, but continue. But yeah, and it was a Wii. I found, like, all the systems of, like, the current era, and I was, like, so happy. And then, like... I woke up in my dream in another dream, and I was at, like, this vacation house, and I was hanging out with one of our friends, Victor, um, and, like, I was so excited. I was like, dude, I just recently found a bunch of, like, gaming systems, and we we're going to have a ton of fun. He's like, all right, awesome, dude, where are they? And I open up my bag, and there's nothing in it, and then I realize, I tell him, I was like, oh, shit, that was a dream. And he's like, oh, fuck, man. And I'm like, crap. <laughs> and then I woke up, and I'm like, wait, which one was the dream? <laughs> That's messed up. Yeah, I, I found, like, all these systems, and they had, like, all the cords and, like, extra controllers. And I was so happy. I was like, I'm going to be, like, the king of the block. I'm Toadette. Congratulations on getting the super boots. These cool kicks power up jumping attacks. That does sound like a cool dream, though. And you'll be able to use new techniques such as practice, okay? <laughs> if you press A, right at the moment, it's over to submit, jump. 
Press A in mid jump. It's basically a ground pound. Yeah. You can also use it in battle. Yeah. Well, that's perfect. Natural. I tried again. Okie dokie. Let's try it again. <laughs> oh, yeah. And those big chests that you saw usually hold items from Mario's upgradable abilities. Yeah, special items. And Toadette is the one who helps you use them. Uh, I was wondering why a random Toadette just appeared out of nowhere. Yeah, because while you're telling your story, you open the chest. But yeah, now Jake has his super boots. Yep. Now you can growl pound. And you can also get through those black things. So let's yep. go back to that puny cage and get them out. Yeah, and if you see any of those pedestals, take them out. In the meantime, we need to figure out how to fuck do this. I'm glad we found the room with the sun, moon, puny star, because we did remember the pattern by yeah. just doing that uh, habitually. <laughs> yeah. But... Sun, moon, puny star. We had, like, some sort of accent to it as well. All right, let's go. Oh, platform puzzle. All for a shine sprite. We should, um, when you, whenever you want to, use the shine sprite on one of your favorite partners at a point in the game. <laughs> okay, because we do have a lot of them. Yeah, I just want to make sure we use them so we can showcase what those do. Oh, coops. Yeah. What is that? It's a badge of some sort. I want it. I always want it. You got charge. charge. Add charge to your tactics menu. What does charge do? Let's see how many BP it is. One. Charge. You have okay. enough for it. Yep. Let's, let's find it. out. All right, now let's get back to the puny cage. Is there anything he pushes? I mean, you're checking, and your answer is no. <laughs> so far, no. So still that's bush. Uh, zero. Still too vicious. To the bush. One more. Let's okay, see. we just waste our waste time. I'm sorry. Well, they say a bird in the hand is worth two in the bush, but you didn't get anything in the bush. So I guess there's no bird in your hand. I guess. <laughs> I, guess. <laughs> I don't even know what I said either. It's okay for you to be it, confused. Ever, it's okay. Wait, are we underwater? Oh, look at that. Thing. No, look at the background behind the black trees. What? I mean, there is water in well, this tree, weird. and we're when we get to the lower lower ground levels, we're underwater. Is that why there's waterfalls on the lower levels? I guess. All right, let's go save those peonies. Um, you got you got flurry, right? Yeah. Yeah. Switch out flurry because. We're going to want to get those punies into the hole after we ground pound them, so you're going to use the puny pedestal, like the puny orb, and then blow them all down the hole. Oh, nice. That was a good idea. I didn't even think of that. Yeah. And then we go to the right, to, f to the jabby place, right? Because that opened up a door. Yeah. Wait, was it up here? Pretty sure. The puny cage? Because there's still this red box that we haven't been able to get yet. I don't know how to get that. I'm assuming we'll get a partner that will illuminate invisible platforms or something. No. Not in this one? No, that's not a power a partner can have. Okay. But what I'm thinking of is your next boot power up. But that's... Oh, like a super jump kind of thing? Yeah, where you just like hold A and you charge up and then it just like... Uh, then you can jump super high. But um, that might not be it either. You, you never know where you don't go. No shiny don't glow. Hey, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, okay, we did it. So now just use your paper thin to get into the uh, cage. And you still have your puny orb, so... Other side. <laughs> yeah. There you go. I just have to find the area. There it is. Oh! Okay, you did it. Yes. But see, now they're not all with you. Yeah, only, only 13 came. <laughs> Flurry can blow every single puny. Go! Uh, put the puny orb back in. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Crap. There you go. Some of them are outside the cage. Stop being a tool. Come on, little girl. <laughs> puny girl. Puny Come girl. Come on, let me blow you. <laughs> oh, wrong way. Sorry. Oh, jeez. Oh, come they on. They are not cooperating. There you go. Okay, there's one. Two... Oh my gosh! You can stop being a dick. Alright, there, you went back to the center. What? Alright, just take the puny orb off then. And then go down the thing. Oh, yeah, cause... Nope. And then go up the pipe. They're up there. Yeah. <gasps> uh, this is why you should have put the puny orb before finding the ground pound thing, because then you would have seen it anyway. <laughs> Alright, there you go. 
It's all right. We all make mistakes. This one puny. <laughs> this Get in there. This baby. This baby was puny. Okay, we have 100. All we need is that one. You know what? You want to just go on ahead without him? <laughs> I, I would, but I feel like that's going to be all the difference. Okay. Okay. Oh, fucking puny, please. Oh, look, he got closer. Yes! God damn. Oh, fucking puny. All right. I'm not looking forward to doing this more because I know I need to do this a lot. No, I think that's the last time Lord Crump traps you in a game. No, blow him through trap doors. Oh, yeah, that's not the best way of doing anything in this game. Because I have to blow him up here. Now here's a good question. Where do we go now? And why do we only have 51 punies? Where did all your other punies go? What the fuck? Oh, wait, you just got to that pipe. Yeah, I need to blow him down there. But I need to find the others. Oh my gosh, what are the punies doing? I don't remember them ever acting up this much. Maybe they just don't like me. You know? Oh look, they're all back now. Yeah, because I just went down and got them. Alright, go to your positions. And I don't know why these guys are just staying over here. Because there's the ground pound hole that you emptied. There you go. Now just blow them off the other side. See? You just gotta go to the other side. And baboosh. <laughs> I don't know how Tama made milkshakes during rehearsal. Those were nice. That was I mean, fun. Why did you do that, though? I just felt like making a milkshake. Like, you saw the supplies in the kitchen, and you were just... Well, like, it was like, um, I heard Katie say, like, I want a milkshake. And I was like, I'm pretty sure it's ice cream. And I was gonna go in there. I was just gonna get spoons full of ice cream. And then I was, I opened up the fridge, and I'm like, you know, there's a lot of milk. I got some whipped cream. That's pretty good. <laughs> and I was like, oh, I got some half and half going on up in this business. <laughs> like, alright. Right. So what's the charge thing? Where is it? Is it only for partner? Oh, it's in tactics. Save up strength to power up your next attack. Maybe you could do that for Flurry's body slam. Maybe. You want to try it for Flurry? Maybe, maybe, yeah. Um, charge. How do I exit? B. Oh, okay. And then press Y to switch and then have Flurry do it. Wait, you want to... Wait, Wait, now that you have your uh, jump, use normal jump on the um, the X the X guy over there. This one? No, X all the way on the right. That guy. Yucks. You want to take out the yucks first. Yeah, that's what I was going to do, but he said X guy. I thought you were talking about the X knots. No. But they, they are part of the X. Oh, you can only charge Mario's attacks. All right. We'll just use body slam on the yucks so that he doesn't summon as many yucks and make this battle tedious. Yeah. But did you see uh, Mario's jump damage is now increased to two because he got the other boots, which is... Oh, they got items. They're probably going to use them, but that rarely happens in a battle. They use, <laughs> they use the only item I want. Okay, well, this x not doesn't even have ten health. What a waste. They only have four. So if you just do a normal jump on them, it'll. if you do the um, action command, yeah, it'll, it'll take them out. Yeah, it'll take them out entirely. Yep. Wait, you wanted the uh, blue shroom? Yeah. I think that's a super shroom. Yeah, it, it, any shroom, you know. Oh shit, we're going overtime again and oh, crap. Sleep. This episode went by fast! Yeah. Maybe uh, it was, uh, I guess it was my story. I don't have many of those on here. Yeah. I'm a bland person, guys. This is the Sun Moon Puny Star episode. Sun Moon Puny, Puny Star. Star. I think we found the name of the episode, probably. Yeah, that we just. We, my work's cut a, out for me. It was a self writing title. Um, Alright, well, I think since we're going over time, we should cut this short. We're gonna go down that pipe in the next episode, but before we leave, you got anything to add, Jake? No, 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 you went down the pipe! Well, I lied to the audience for the first time in my... <laughs> <laughs> you don't get any outro. Screw you, Jake. I didn't have an outro, it's okay. <laughs>